Okay, now, yep. So now we're going to check the um, the port settings. So firstly, we, we close it down. Can we start again? Go to My Computer. Go to Property, right click, and then go to Properties. Then go to Hardware. Then go to Device Manager. Then you need to go to Ports, Com, and LTPs. And then you will see the uh, prolific uh, USB to serial COM port, uh, which is using COM port 2, so number 2 port on, onto the laptop. Okay, so it's using number 2, so we're going to check that against the Light Edit program. So double click on Light Edit, open up Light Edit. Yep. Then go to Options, go to Connection. We're just going to check that it's communicating. Just one. Uh, address of the controller is number one, and the the COM port for that USB interface is COM number two, which is correct. So OK. So now we can communicate via. So we open a direct communication, and the address of the controller is number one. So OK. Now now it's just checking. It's preparing the communication on the bottom there. Once it goes green, it means that it's communicating. So now we're connected up to the actual ACO3 controller. Sorry, and then now we can actually control it, we can monitor it, and we can uh, set up some details.